meantime, Garrett Cole went five and two thirds innings as he pitched into the sixth. 84 pitches, nine strikeouts. As we continue to watch the game, let's hear from Garrett Cole talking to the media. You had a really good rhythm going with Gary Sanchez. Can you just explain how that relationship has been and how comfortable you feel throwing to him at this point? Um, yeah, it's been nice to work with him the last couple of times. Um, I thought we were on the same page um, a lot today, and the few times that we weren't, we um, discussed it in between innings, and um, you know that's always that's always helpful. Um, and I, I, I mean, I. I thought he was sharp behind the plate, giving me good targets. Um, and he called some really nice sequences. It's helpful that he knows uh, the other squad better than I do. Um, so uh, uh, I, I feel a bit fortunate there. So, 84 pitches, nine strikeouts. Do you feel comfortable with where you're at, satisfied with where you're at, considering opening day is 11 days away now? Yeah, I, I mean, I don't. St I still don't want to put the cart before the horse, but um, you know. Uh, hopefully we can recover well this week um, and build off this in the next turn and uh, be ready to go. But, um, yeah, I'm looking forward to putting my feet up because it was hot today. <laughs> uh, Michael King was at the podium before you, and he had mentioned that you told him as he's trying to develop that slider not to throw it on flat ground because your arm angle is totally different. Who told you that, or did you come up with that on your own? How did that all come about? Yeah, I mean it's not an it's it's not a it's not an absolute, but um, I don't, there's a few conversations with some guys in Houston um, and you know other teammates of mine that have broke off to the league, and uh, I, I just feel like if you're really trying to hammer the shape, um, it's important to have a little bit of a slope to work with. Uh, it does get your hand uh, a little bit farther out in front. Um, it's not to say that sliders on flat ground are pointless, but um, I do find that uh, that was helpful for me and, and, and a few other guys. So, Thank you. Yep. Pete Caldera, you're up next. You can go ahead and unmute. Uh, just curious how you feeling in the later races. Hey, Pete. Pete, we got a – I couldn't make that out. We had a bad connection there. Can you hear me now? Okay, okay. Um, let me come back. He to just you said what, what he, he said. You said, how did I feel in the later innings? Yeah, yeah, that was, that was it. Uh, um, I felt pretty good. I was, I was kind of tired in the sixth. But um, I was able to maintain fastball command for the most part. Um, and it was good to push the limit a little bit, uh, especially being hot. It was just it was a fun challenge. Take the next question from Jake Siner. Jake, the AP. Hey, Garrett, just wanted to, I don't know if the schedule's been set yet, but are you thinking you're going to pitch in one of the exhibition games coming up this weekend or, or pitch before that to give yourself the extra day for opening day? Just curious what your thoughts are about the, the scheduling. It just hasn't been decided yet. Take the next question from Christy Ackert. Christy, go ahead. Hey, Garrett, uh, just curious how your recovery went the first time throwing off the mound um, last, last week and how you feel going into this. Uh, it was good. Um, I thought I was prepared. I, I made some adjustments with the fastball. Um, I, I didn't really have any, any scenarios where I, I lost command, so I thought I was improved from that aspect. And um, I'm, I'm pretty tired right now. So <laughs> uh, we'll, we'll, we'll see. I, I don't anticipate. I, I'm certainly not anticipating uh, being a significant challenge, but it was hot, and uh, I am tired as of right now. So, thank you. Yep. Lindsay Adler, go ahead. Hey Garrett, hope uh, you, Amy, and the baby are doing well. Doing great. Um, I'm curious, how has you know has this situation been sort of a mental adjustment for you in kind of thinking about how to plan out your routine? And I'm just curious if um, the circumstances have changed the way that you go about things before before your outings yeah I think they I think they have uh, I mean just with the dynamic here at the field uh, with the masks and the time that you know people spend at the field is less 
we're staggered kind of coming in at this point still. Um, generally though, I've tried to stay on the same routine, uh, certainly physically preparing myself, um, but it, it just the dynamic in, in here is just so different. Um, and you know, we're as far as as far as the baby goes. I don't. I I didn't. I uh, I'm enjoying every minute of that. I don't. I don't see that being. Uh, I don't see that being detrimental at all. So, Sweeney Murdy, go ahead and unmute. Hey, Garrett, uh, regardless of what day your next outing is, how will you determine the workload? Do you like to back off from, I mean, you got up to 84 today. Do you like to back off? Do you want to stay the same? I, I would normally say, I would normally say continue to push, um, you know, but uh, I'm going to have those conversations with the guys uh, and see what Aaron and Matt kind of, you know, I don't want to be inefficient on, on either end of the spectrum. So, um, um, so uh, we'll, we'll see. And it may depend on, it may depend on if there's an extra day this turn or not. So, yeah. Is that the biggest determining factor? Is there anything about how you come out of today that goes into that? Um, I would just try to, I'm just going to try to see how, see how I bounce back probably next 24, 48 hours. And then, um, certainly certainly not not backtrack or um but you know if it's worth it to just kind of repeat the same load um and then and then build off of that or maybe push it you know slightly so that maybe you feel like you have just a little bit extra uh rope the next uh for for opening day rather um it, it it'll 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 depend on it'll depend just pretty much how i feel kind of throwing the ball and and, and kind of see kind of see where i'm at okay thank you yeah Dan Martin, go ahead. You have the next question. Garrett, uh, I know you said the schedule has not been set yet for your next uh, appearance, but do, do you care whether or does it matter whether you're you're pitching in a simulated game like this or an exhibition game against opposing hitters? Would, would you have a preference there? Um, I, I, I haven't. Yeah, I just haven't put a ton of thought into it to give you. A, a, I was just trying to focus on today. Uh, and now I'm trying to drink some water, and then I'll, I'll get I'll get to the next start in the next 24, 48 hours, and I'll have a better idea. 